since EA Sports delayed their new college football game another year, I'll just have to show you guys the next best thing. Welcome to NCAA Football 24, basically. This is the latest version of NCAA Football with up-to-date rosters and even the college football playoff. And today, I'm taking control of my alma mater, the University of South Alabama, in the college football playoff. And if I don't shock the world and become the biggest underdog to ever win the national championship, I have got to tweet this video's most liked comment. In the semifinals, look at the overall difference, dude. Hey, at least Lee Corso has faith in us, though. I mean, we are America's team. It doesn't get much more American than USA. Now, for the semifinal against Georgia, as a side quest, South Alabama star running back LaDamian Webb has got to score three touchdowns on top of a win for us to officially advance into the national championship. With how big the talent difference is, we might not even score one. We have a bunch of players over 90. We don't even have a player over 80. Can we at least win the coin toss? Hey! Hey, at least I won something today. Now the goal here, drive number one, do not throw a pick six. Like it is gonna be so hard not to do bad things against this Georgia defense. Like it's one of the best defenses of all time. Play number one from scrimmage. If we can just get a positive yard, I'll take it. We didn't go backwards. Disregard the team rankings and the record and everything. This is 1v4 in the college football playoff semifinal. The Chick-fil-A Peach Bowl. Another run with LaDamian Webb and you'll see a lot of that today. We're gonna have to see a lot of that. We're have any chance to win. Three straight runs with Webb. We're gonna get the first down, barely, but it's enough. Look at Southpaw, the best mascot in all of college football. Now, I am scared to throw the ball down the field, and I'm gonna have to eventually throw it if we're gonna win here. So why not throw it to Webb here? Screen pass. I mean... At least we got positive yards. And keep in mind, yeah, I might would be able to squeak out a 7-3 to three win, but that would eliminate us from the college football playoff because remember, we have got to get three rushing touchdowns with Webb before the day ends. And right now, it looks like he's going to have a pretty good game. No mistakes. No mistakes. Make the catch, Lincoln Sefcik with the catch deep into Georgia territory. If we're gonna make it this close to the end zone, we've got to make it count and punch it in with Webb. If we could get a touchdown on the ground with him this early, that would be huge. Oh my God, Voison. Oh my God, he dropped it, no. We could have literally downed the ball at the one. Let's just not throw a pick or something here. You're so open, dude. Please hang on to the ball. Yes, I'm actually going for it. We could kick the field goal, but no, dude, that's not how we do things around here. If I'm gonna get this close, I'm gonna punch it into the end zone. Hopefully anyway. Wayne? <laughs> It's so far behind them, bro. Carter Bradley, our quarterback, you've got to lead them. Oh, this has been an absolute travesty of a start. Killed the quarterback. Fumble? Death, death, death. Imagine the scenes if we actually force a three and out. We sacked him. What in the world is Stetson Bennett doing? That USA Jaguar defensive line eating. Imagine the scenes we actually force a three and out. It's a screen. Richardson? Okay, so that's just not fair. That's just not even fair. Third down and one, I'm bringing the entire city of Uganda on this play. I've got to stop UJ in the back. How is that successful? How on God's earth did that play pick up a first down? I've got to do some investigating. Hold on a second. Dear Stetson, what were you thinking? Interception would be massive right here. We almost got one off the tip. Get to the QB. I beg, I beg. We did, thank God. Let's please keep them out of field goal range. I'll take it. Oh my God. I think we're actually going to force them to punt. I can't believe one quarter has been played and we're not losing by three touchdowns. We're actually forcing Georgia to punt. Let me tell you boys, that's a massive dub. I thought they were going to score every single drive. Lacey off the snap. He's going to hang on. That's actually a completed pass for a first down. Oh, Bradley, you're just not a fast boy, are you? Can you get the edge? No, you can't. We lose four. Back to Webb. And maybe I should hand it off to him every single play. We're going to run a little bit of up-tempo right here. Third down to one after the 13-yard gain. Same play twice in a row because that's what they taught me to do at Harvard. And that's exactly why. Screen pass here to Webb. We have blockers out in front. We have blockers. We have plenty of blockers. Ladanian Webb. First down within the 30. That is huge. You remember the glory days when screen passes were actually OP? We're actually completely dominating Georgia right now. But can we actually turn that into points here? Carter Bradley, I'm just never, ever going to run read option with him ever again. Somebody's got to get open here, bro. Somebody. <gasps> Nobody did. This might be a massive mistake, but I've got to score a touchdown eventually. This is such a big play. 
and nobody's open. Nobody's even close. Townsend, what in the world? That's a miracle. That's an absolute miracle. Jesus Christ himself blessed me right there. That's the only explanation. If we can actually get Webb's first touchdown, I'll be the happiest man on the entire earth, and that's a first down and goal within the five. We cannot get this close and not score a touchdown. It just can't happen. Webb, please. Webb, please. Oh, he stopped just shy. It's going to be a second and goal from the two. Can the South Alabama offensive line hold off the Georgia defensive line here in the goal line? We're just going to pound it right up the middle. Ladanian Webb, touchdown, Jags! South Alabama's actually going on top of Georgia, seven to nothing. And not to mention, Ladanian Webb got his first touchdown of the day. But somehow, with barely over a half left to go, I've got to punch it in two more times. Like, there's no way way we even get the ball in Georgia territory two more times this game, right? I'm gonna remain optimistic, though. I mean, we are winning. I'm gonna speak an interception into existence. That would make me the happiest boy on this side of the Mississippi attempting to kill the QB. And we didn't. And they got a first. Oh, please. Oh, please. He's wide open. That's a first down for Kyrus Jackson. As long as you bend, just don't break. Can we just please keep them out the end zone? Like, if we could just have a lead at halftime against Georgia, I would be so happy. So freaking happy. You'll see a massive smirk on my face if we can somehow, some way, get a stop here. What is Stetson Bennett doing? Oh, gosh. Can we stop them on fourth and inches twice in a row? Come on, USA. USA. Turnover. Let's go. Miracles are happening here in the Peach Bowl. What the freak is actually going on? Imagine we can find a way to get some Mickey Mouse points here before halftime. That would be huge. Screen pass. Offensive lineman. Why don't you block? It's fine, it's fine. We're just gonna punt the football away and just be glad that we have a lead over freaking Georgia in the college football playoff semifinal, man. That's if, uh... We keep him from bringing it back for a touchdown. That was kind of sketchy. But boy, somehow, some way, we lead 7-0 at halftime. What are the odds we actually hang on in the second half? And what sucks, too, is even if we win, we've got to get two more touchdowns with Webb. And that's like one per quarter that we have to get. And Georgia gets the ball here to start the half, too. Like, do we even have enough time to get two more touchdowns? As you can tell, we are literally bringing everybody. And, uh... Maybe I shouldn't. Oh, we're there. We're not there, actually. He very easily could have took that to the house, and I would not have been smiling. Interception would be massive, and it's wide open. Brock Bowers, the first time we see him today, a little legend. Now, the thing is, if Georgia is going to score, at least do it quickly. We just save as much time possible off the clock for me to have a chance to score two more touchdowns. Play action. Oh, we almost killed him. Please don't let him score. Oh, he's wide open. That's a touchdown, Georgia. No! You just knew eventually they were going to strike. I mean, it's freaking Georgia. After everything we've been through, we're back to being tied. I told you guys it's OP. Webb again, first down off the screen. The tight end, he's open. He's going to get a couple yards. Webb, I beg. Webb, I actually beg. I think we got it barely, just barely. I think for the rest of the game, we really do need to go up-tempo. We really have got to save every second off that clock possible. Again, I mean, it's the best play ever invented. Four yards. We need four freaking yards. Can we do it, Webb? Hold up the middle. Oh, my God. It's a fourth down on what I've got to go for. It. I've got to. I feel like we've gotten too lucky today. I feel like we've gotten too lucky. And our luck continues, Webb. It's a first down. Just don't get hurt. Like, that would kind of ruin the challenge. Webb's going to take a few plays off to catch his breath. Mick Reynolds, the freshman, is going to pick up another nice little seven-yard gain. Dink and dunk, dink and dunk, dink and dunk. Mick Reynolds, we're going to get a bounce. One-yard line, one-yard line, one-yard line. That is huge. That is absolutely freaking massive. I told you guys, screen pass is OP. Can we actually regain the lead on number one Georgia and at the same time get our second rushing touchdown of the day? Not quite. I told you guys, same play twice in a row. It's what they taught me to do at Harvard. There's so many Georgia jerseys, but we fit through. Let's go. Touchdown number two for Webb. On the brink of the fourth quarter. This is actually insane. 
Running backs open. Boy, right there, Miller. Oh, my God. Miller, you've got to pick that off. It's literally a national championship berth hitting right off your shoulder pads. I cannot begin to describe how massive a stop would be right here. It will give us a chance to get our third touchdown. Miller, he heard the footsteps. He dropped the pick last play, but that time did just enough to get off the field. Can we hang on for one more quarter and at the same time get our third touchdown and actually advance into the national championship? Can I please not choke this away? I've got to make my alma mater proud. Look at some of those yards, Webb. Some of those yards. We get a first down and much more Latanian Webb. I'm telling you, he's a monster. Oh my God, please hang on. Jalen Wayne, you've got to hang on, bro. Can the screen pass bail us out one more time? We have the blockers. Ladanium Webb. Oh, my God. Make the blocks. Webb down within the 20-yard line. We are so close. We are so freaking close. A field goal would be great and all right now, but now nah, we're in four-down territory. We've got to punch us in with Webb. It doesn't look like it's going to be right there. Another Mickey Mouser. Another Mickey Mouser. McReynolds. It's going to be a third and seven. Webb up the middle. That's going to be a first down. It's going to be so close. Fourth down to one. We're running. Hurry up. You best believe we're going for this. This one singular yard could be the difference in completing today's challenge or not. Don't let me down, Webb. You haven't yet. And you continue to make me proud. That's huge. I like this. I actually like this, Webb. Oh no, oh no, I'm actually running hurry up because I think they're going to take him out because he's tired. They're kind of clogging the line now too. I'm kind of scared. Yeah, dude, we can't have that. Need five yards in two plays. Five yards in two plays. Webb up the middle. He's going to be stopped short. Oh God. Can we do it, dude? Can we actually do it? I beg. Webb, Webb, touchdown! Let's go! The most clutch play you might ever see in the history of the channel! His third touchdown of the day, and that was so close. What great blocking by the O-line. And at this point, literally, all we have to do is hold on for the win, and we're into the national championship. Which, if we do hold on, we'll have to see who won the other semifinal to see who we have to face in the natty, either Michigan or TCU. Complete domination by America's team. Somebody get to the quarterback, finally! Stetson is not happy to send us into the final. To send us into the final. Get to the QB, let's go! The biggest upset in the history of college football. One of the greatest sights I have ever seen. USA heading into the final. Georgia cannot believe what just happened. But hold the celebrations, my friends. We still have a lot more work to do. But first, we have to go see who won the other semifinal. The two versus three seed in the college football semifinal. Who will we be taking on in the natty? Of course since Michigan to grab the dub. Everything that we've worked so hard for today comes down to this. Why in the world is Corso picking us again? Oh my god, look at that meter, man. It's jiggling so hard. Michigan might actually be harder to beat than Georgia. How are we supposed to stop a 98 overall running back? South Alabama in the national championship, just not a sight I ever expected to see. Hilarious enough, though, not the first time we've played in the Rose Bowl this season. I've got to finish so you guys can not tweet for my account. Kick return for a touchdown to start things off would be nice and we didn't even make it to the 25. Feed web all day every day and that's exactly why he can catch the football too maybe i shouldn't throw it to him though when there's a man right on him this is going to my true freshman running back braylon mcreynolds and he gets a first down and much more Look at the true freshman go! That's homegrown talent right there. Five minutes from my house he grew up. Webb, to the outside. Did he get it? Just enough! Southpaw happy once again. Now my goal here, can we actually complete a pass down the field? Voicen? Voicen, let's go! He follows me on Twitter! Fun fact, this man who just caught the ball has his literal twin starting on the defensive free safety. No lie, I think they actually had a third brother on the team too, but he transferred last year. Is read option really my best course of action here? Maybe it is. Ha, oh, so close down to the two. Are we really about to pound the ball down Michigan's throat the entire opening drive in the national championship game? And the answer is yes, let's go. Let Damian Webb doing what he does best and scores another touchdown. That's his fourth of the playoff. But now the problem is how in the world are we going to stop Michigan's 98-yard running back from running all over us today? 
They might not have to because they might bring back every kick for a touchdown. That's kind of stinky. I have a bad feeling their running backs going to average like 74 yards a carry today. I mean, more of that, JJ. More of that. Oh my! Oh my god! That's my first ever user pick on college football revamp! Let's go! There's a flag though. What's that for? Offensive pass interference? If I decline this, is this actually my football? What the frick is going on? We've got to capitalize. Never in a million years did I think I was going to get a pick on that drive. I thought they were going to score in like two plays. Colin Lacey? Okay, so that's just not what I needed to do. That's also not what I needed to do. Oh my god. So things went good, bad, then good again, now bad again. Why did I do that? I should have just ran the dang ball. Oh my, Will Fawn again? Oh wow. Oh no. Oh please? Okay, Thomas, JJ McCarthy sacked again. I'm not gonna lie, if we can hold him to a field goal post to a touchdown, I'm gonna be a smiling boy, and you best believe I'm grinning from ear to ear. And at the end of one, the Cinderella underdog story continues. Now, I would love to giggle at a missed field goal here, and I'm not giggling. Goal on this drive, just not throw another interception, at least not on the first play. Okay, so that's not how he wanted to start the drive either. He's so open. That's a pick again. That's a pick again. I always get baited on the cover too. Why am I so dumb? All I can do is just move on, boys. I can move on, lock in, bend, not break. At least as of right now, we're limiting Blake. Please? Blake? Doesn't pick up the first. I mean, again, I know it sucks, but I would much rather give up the field goal here than give up the lead. Bringing the entire city of Alabama on this play, and it just didn't work. We just didn't get to the QB. Oh, no. Oh, no. It's a second and goal from the one. They've got to be running the ball here, right? There's no way they're dumb enough to throw this. Like I said, they're not dumb enough to throw this. Blake eventually strikes, and we should not be down. It's all my fault. I need the screen pass to save us again. They kind of got it covered this time. Webb, he's going to break a tackle. Oh, my God, let Damian Webb put the team on his back. That's huge. Who's going to make the big play here? It's going to be you. You're wide open, Townsend. No, dude. He was wide open. I'm an absolute firm believer in the fact that ball doesn't lie. We're going to prove that theory right here. I beg. I beg. I beg. Boom. I mean, he very well might have died, but at least he hung on. Again. Again, Colin Lacey, just like that, we have the ball within the 30. Webb again. Oh, I think he just got enough for the first. Carter, Carter Bradley, he literally has like 70 speed and he just got a first down. First and goal, there is literally zero option other than handing the ball off here to Webb. Actually, there is another option. The freshman McReynolds, I guess Webb was tired. And the freshman, ooh, doesn't quite score in the natty, but we are gonna run hurry up here and try to get this true freshman into the end zone. At the same time, not leave Michigan with any time to score. Bounce it outside. Oh, what a play there by the D lineman. Webb back in the ball game. We have got to strike for six here. Ladanian Webb, of course he does. Something's got me feeling wild right now, and for some reason I wanna go for two. Hope this isn't a mistake. Like, why the heck not when you have a running back like Webb? With that, we go into halftime, and boys, we are literally one half away from South Alabama's first ever bowl win being the national championship. I mean, I guess we did technically win the semifinal, but you get where I'm going with it. If we can keep Michigan from scoring here to start the second half, that would be huge. But I mean, they did get 19 yards on the first play from scrimmage. Oh my god. Oh, that's a first. That's unfortunate. Well, there goes their running attack. They bring pressure because the only time my defense is effective. Until a 98 overall running back stiff arms us in the face. No pressure defense, just the national championship on the line. And their quarterback picked up 12. Michigan and Blake Corum, 98 rated versus South Alabama in our front seven. <laughs> and I guess you could have imagined who won that battle. <laughs> We're some big hitters over here. He's open. We're going to be there and set up for a fourth and six. They've got to kick the field goal, right? No way they go for it. Field goal is up and it is good. But we still retain a two-point lead. Okay, Carter. 
Okay, Carter! One more block. If we had one more block, he could have really took that all the way with his 70 speed. You best believe we're going to focus on pounding this rock with Webb. Again, he ran into his own lineman, but he still picks up four yards in the first. Hey, he broke a school rushing record, too. Not too shabby to do that in the natty. Put your fours up one more quarter, and your USA Jaguars are national champions. Oh, my God. Please, please, please. No. I thought there was more potential here. Oh, what the frick? What the frick is going on? What in God's name? What in God's name? That right there, my friends, is karma. Ball doesn't lie. I told you I'm a big believer in it. How on earth do I still have the ball? Triple option? Web? Oh, he's going to be stuffed just before picking up the first. No way they stuff him twice in a row. Open space! Touchdown, Jags! That's a two-possession lead. That's massive. Webb is an absolute demon confirmed. Well, this extra point makes it a two-possession game, and they almost blocked it, but we actually have a nine-point lead. Things are looking so promising right now, but there's still so much time left. And remember, I'm the one holding the controller. So much bad can still happen. Pick. Thank you. Interception. There's no way. Daryl Luter, our highest rated player in the entire team, 90 overall, gets the pick, which can very well steal a national championship for your team, USA. Oh my god, Webby legend. All we need is half a main dingo and we get ourselves a first down. It wasn't ever a question with Ladanian Webb toting the rock. We could have easily scored one more, but we have more class than that here at South Alabama. As it's done, I've officially won the college football playoff with my alma mater. Miracles do in fact happen here on the channel. USA! 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 Now if you enjoyed that one, click right here to watch my brand new South Alabama NCAA Dynasty series, which just started on my brand new NCAA football channel. Or you can just click right here to watch another video on the channel that I know you'll enjoy. Subscribe to, please. Thank you.